into the tram lines. KA100 Senior looking for the green flag. And we've got it down to turn number one. Lemke trying to hang tough on the outside. He'll instantly drop to second. Yeah, look for Alex Kardashian again. The Purdue Grand Prix winner this year is trying to come back and do it for a 1-2 with the second appearance back in the cart this year. A little bit of hustle and tussle. The mid-pack is going to shake it up. I think Levy was able to make up a couple more positions on the outside coming out of turn number five. Yeah, great start there for Aiden Levy to make up a couple as he watched the field work its way on through out of turn number seven and eight over through nine. Alex Kardashian with a nice lead beginning. We got a few tangled together. Looks like uh, one of the Merlin entries, one of the MPG Motorsports, and a Harbor Doss, another MPG Motorsports, Cart Republic, I believe, all collected over in turn six. As they come down to the front stretch, though, Lemke closing back up to Kardashian with a decent first lap. Oh, Wait, problem for one oh. more. One of the PCRs has gone around over here. And, or no, that, is that one of the Blacked Out Cart Republics? One of the two has gone around. It is one of the KRs, the 981 of Nikki, uh, Nikki Soello, the Route 66 Print Series for years. We got more around over here. Grayson Redson has gone around in the Techno, and as well, the number 57 machine. That was Steve Welk, who was running in the 10th spot and was making his return to the seat. And he and Grayson Redson, a little bit uh, of hand signals there from Redson as the lead has changed. Brandon Lemke has gone to the point. Kardashian back to second. Right behind Kardashian. Steven Dial not too far back. He is on the back bumper as he is now looking low on the inside of Kardashian. Backs off ever so slightly. Here comes Austin Jers to join the mix to make it a five-car tango for the lead. Look for Tristan Faber. He is able to get by. There's a pass for second attempted from, uh, I believe that was Dial. Not able to get it done. And now here comes Jers trying to pass back. Gives a little body slam, and that breaks up the front pack. And that allows Tristan Farber to get through to third as Austin Jers, a little bit physical getting by Steven Dial as Dial was just trying to play recovery mode. So all three drivers there, third, fourth, and fifth, quicker than the race leader. They are slowly bringing that five-car pack back together, or they were, but Jers, Goes by for third on Farber. Farber now defends from Dial. And Austin Jers, the rookie, fastest on the racetrack. Back to the leaders here, going through three and four. Brandon Lemke, Alexander Kardashian, Austin Jers. There's the pass for the lead. Kardashian back to the point. Lemke to second. And here comes Jers. He's two car lengths away with six and a half laps to go. Yeah. Four laps to go. Alexander Kardashian leads a five-car group here at the home of Merlin Nation and Brandon Lemke trying to bring him a checkered flag on day number one. They'll exit to earn seven. Lemke's half a cart length away. Lemke all over the back bumper of uh, Kardashian. I don't know if he's trying to push him away or if he's maybe trying to force a mistake out of Kardashian. Coming into turn 11, no one defends. They all stay how they're supposed to. Austin Jers slowly closing up, it appears, and then he fades back away. But I think he may have saved the past couple laps to turn it up in the final two. Let's see what he's got. Three to go this time by Alex Kardashian, Brandon Lemke, Austin Jers, and again, Dial and Farber still there as well. Lemke's close. Does he go in three? Here he comes. There he goes. Brandon Lemke to the lead once again. Kardashian to second. Here goes Austin Jers trying for P2. He'll muscle his way with Kardashian. Doesn't get clear. Kardashian holds on and Lemke gets a bigger gap. One and a half car length set it to six. Two to go. Can Kardashian find a second win like Lemke did? A cart length back to turn number three. Brandon Lemke, your leader here in Merlin Nation's hometown, home racetrack for Franklin Motorsports. Pass for fourth. Stephen or third, Stephen Dial is by on Austin Jers and Tristan Farber has had an issue. Farber is gone. And the leaders making their way through six and seven for the second to last time coming in to turn number Look eight. Look at Tristan Farber here, his head in his hands. He knew he had a good shot at that one. And the 911 Cosmic is out of it here in turn number three with a mechanical. Kardashian back to the bumper, white flag this time. Kardashian working for all it's worth, a back bumper Lemke. He's got to get a good run out of here and close it up, coming out of turn one to turn three. Cross the line one more time, checks back, see if he has any help. He doesn't. Trails by half a cart length, gets a decent run, swings wide. I don't think he's close enough to make a move in turn number three. Nothing into three, and Lemke knows how to defend here. He grew up racing at this very racetrack. Brandon Lemke goes low into four. Blocks the inside. Kardashian opens up. Gets the momentum into five. Lemke blocks again. Dial blocking as well for third. Kardashian is side by side for the lead, and he gets through into Ooh. six. And there's contact. Lemke got the bumper hook behind the tire. More contact. Dial goes wide. Jers to second. Kardashian to the lead with two corners to go. Jers had a clean escape going through all that carnage. Now we're coming up in turn 11. Going to defend is going to be Kardashian. And look for the outside line. That is also Dial trying to get on the action. 
Jur is not able to get there. Kardashian, what a final lap move. There goes side by side for second. Alexander Kardashian wins on Saturday in Dowsman, and Jurs finishes in second. What a finish, what a final lap of fireworks in KA Senior. And look at the battles across the line. Alexander Kardashian wins the main event here in KA Senior, presented by Wolcher Racing Engines. What a result for Kardashian. Jurs second, the rookie, with a really impressive main event. More carnage across the line. One driver trying to hop to get across it there, and 